Farmers at Katsuhanzala village in Kilifi say they can hardly afford the fuel, a critical commodity in the irrigation exercise, a situation that has forced them to abandon part of their farms. It has become difficult to sustain their families with the high prices of food commodities such as maize flour and frequent attacks by elephants worsening their plight. <laughs> ile sehemu ambayo nalima ni ya ku ni ya kujitafutia chakula tayari cha nyumbani lakini siezi siezi lima mahali kwingine pakubwa kwa biashara another group of small scale farmers from Katana Hakee village disclosed that the areas has also been hit hard by the ongoing drought which is characterized by the highly scorching heat of the sun mafuta iko juu njaa pia ndio hiyo unga uko gali ukangana pesa ya mafuta kwa siku huko na siku za ukame na ukame na ndo huo shambani kuna tekana maji the drought situation is not different in nakuru county livestock farmers have been forced to move into the production of silage years after abandoning the system that is used to preserve animal feeds futa iteremshwe bei na sisi ili tulime vizuri ili tuweze kujimudu tulime kilimo biashara pamoja na chakula chetu ili tuendelee kujendeleza kimaisha but with the harsh weather conditions and a rise in animal feed prices the farmers have reverted to the preservation method that involves chopping maize stalks and mixing them with molasses the farmers term the ongoing drought as an eye opener to many farmers who had forgotten about the preservation method saying that the preservation method will rescue many farmers during the dry season mimi kama mwaka wa pita mimi nilikuwa na shakura mingi kwa hivyo si kusumbuka mwaka hiyo na hata saa hii niliasa ya kusiaga asaile jingine nilikuwa ninabakisha kama miezi mbili hivi according to the farmers the livestock feed could last for over five years robi omondi k24